Hola amigos y sean muy bienvenidos de nuevo a mi canal. En esta ocasión les traigo otro video de Estudiemos Juntos y es que estos videos han funcionado mucho como el video que hicimos de Estudiemos Juntos o Preparémonos Juntos o Practiquemos Juntos para la entrevista de la ciudadanía. Les ha servido mucho porque este tipo de videos ustedes muchas veces no tienen con quién practicar eh, y de esta manera ustedes simplemente ponen el video y pueden practicar. Entonces, eh, este video es acerca de las 100 preguntas. No es para que estudien en sí las 100 preguntas, es más bien para que ustedes practiquen. En esta ocasión, Carlos nos va a ayudar a hacerles las preguntas y les va a dar cierta cantidad de tiempo para que ustedes puedan responderla. Después de eso, vendrá la respuesta para que ustedes verifiquen. Y es que miren, hay muchos videos de cómo estudiar las 100 preguntas y casi no hay videos para practicar las 100 preguntas. Y es que si uno no practica, no se da cuenta qué tanto le falta para prepararse lo mejor que pueda para la entrevista. Entonces, en esta ocasión hemos hecho este video para las 100 preguntas. Espero que les sea útil. Ayúdenme como siempre, ya saben, dándole like, suscribiéndose si no lo han hecho para que tengan acceso a todos los videos que tenemos. Y bien importante siempre que le den like a estos videos para que YouTube los promocione y así le llegue a más gente que necesitan esta información, así como ustedes les está sirviendo. Muy bien amigos, entonces comencemos nuestro video. What do we show loyalty to when we say the pledge of allegiance? What do we show loyalty to when we say the pledge of allegiance? To the United States. To the flag. What is the name of the speaker of the House of Representatives now? What is the name of the speaker of the House of Representatives now? Nancy Pelosi. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of expression, freedom of speech, freedom of assembly, freedom to petition the government, freedom of religion, the right to bear arms. Name one right only for United States citizens. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Run for federal office. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Give up loyalty to other countries. Defend the Constitution and the laws of the United States. Obey the laws of the United States. Serve in the U.S. military. Serve do important work for the nation if needed. Be loyal to the United States. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Serve on a jury. Vote in a federal election. What is the supreme law of the land? What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. What is freedom of religion? What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. 
What is one right or freedom of the First Amendment? What is one right or freedom of the First Amendment? Speech, religion, assembly, press, petition the government. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty, pursuit of happiness. What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. What is the economic system in the United States? What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalism economy, market economy. How many amendments does the Constitution have? How many amendments does the Constitution have? 27. What did the Declaration of Independence do? What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announce our independence. Declare our independence. Said that the United States is free. What is an amendment? What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution, an addition to the Constitution. Name one state that borders Canada. Name one state that borders Canada. Maine, New Hampshire, Vermont, New York, Pennsylvania, Pennsylvania, Ohio, Michigan, Minnesota. North Dakota, Montana, Idaho, Washington, Alaska. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. What is the capital of the United States? What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Missouri River, Mississippi River. Name one state that borders Mexico. Name one state that borders Mexico. California, Arizona, New Mexico, Texas. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. Name one U.S. territory. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico, U.S. Virgin Islands, American Soma. Northern Mariana Islands, Guam. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. 
World War I, World War II, Korean War, Vietnam War, Persian Gulf War. Who was president during World War I? Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Free the slaves. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Free the slaves. Save the Union. Let the United States during the Civil War. What did Susan B. Anthony do? What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's right. Fought for civil rights. What is the name of the President of the United States now? What is the name of the President of the United States now? Donald Trump. We elect a president for how many years? We elect a president for how many years? Four. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Mike Pence. In what month do we vote for the President? In what month do we vote for the President? November. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. Who does a U.S. senator represent? Who does a U.S. senator represent? All the people of the state. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. Name your U.S. representative. Name your U.S. representative. When was the Constitution written? When was the Constitution written? 1787. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. 
The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison, Alexander Hamilton, John Jay. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4, 1776. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. The Founding Fathers wrote the Constitution. There were 13 original states. Name three. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire. Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut, New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware, Maryland, Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia. Who makes federal laws? Who makes federal laws? Congress, Senate, and the House of Representatives. What is the rule of law? What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Leaders must obey the law. Government must obey the law. No one is above the law. How many U.S. Senators are there? How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. Who is in charge of the executive branch? Who is in charge of the executive branch? The President. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? What stops a branch of government from becoming too powerful? Check and balance, separation of powers. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and the House of Representatives. Name one branch or part of the government. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress, legislative, president, executive, the courts, judicial. Who is the governor of your state now? Who is the governor of your state now? Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. What are the two major political parties in the United States? What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. How many justices are there in the Supreme Court? 
How many justices are there in the Supreme Court? Nine. What is the political party of the president now? What is the political party of the president now? Republican. Under our constitution, some of the powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? Under our constitution, some of the powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money, to declare war, to create an army. What is the capital of your state? What is the capital of your state? Under the Constitution, some of the power belongs to the states. What is one power of the states? Under our Constitution, some of the power belongs to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. Provide protection. Give a driver's license. Approve zoning and land use. What are two cabinet level positions? What are two cabinet level positions? Who is the commander in chief of the military? Who is the commander in chief of the military? The president. What is the highest court of the United States? What is the highest court of the United States? The Supreme Court. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. What does the judicial branch do? What does the judicial branch do? Review laws, explain laws, resolve disputes, decide if a law goes against the Constitution. Who signs bills to become law? Who signs bills to become law? The President. What does the President's Cabinet do? What does the president's cabinet do? Advise the president. Who vetoes bills? Who vetoes bills? The president. What is one reason colonists came to America? What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom, political liberty, religious freedom, economy opportunity, practice their religion, escape persecution. When is the last day? You can send in federal income tax forms. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15. 
What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans, people from Africa. What does the Constitution do? What does the Constitution do? Set up the government, define, defines the government, protects the basic rights of Americans. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians, Native Americans. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? What are two ways Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote, join a political party, help with a campaign, join a civic group, join a community group, When must all men register for the Selective Service? When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18, between 18 and 26. Why did the colonists fight the British? Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes, because the British Army stated in their houses, because they didn't have self-government. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizen 18 and older can vote. You don't have to pay a poll tax to vote. Any citizen can vote. Women and men can vote. Male, a male citizen of any race can vote. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War, the war between the states. Who is the father of our country? Who is the father of our country? George Washington. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery, economic reasons, states' rights. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? What is one thing that Benjamin Franklin is famous for? Started the first free libraries. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. War of 1812, Mexican-American War, Civil War, Spanish-American War. Who was the first president? Who was the first president? George Washington.
What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory, Louisiana. What major event happened in the United States on September 11, 2001? What major event happened in the United States on September 11, 2001? Terrorists attacked the United States. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights, work for equality, for all Americans. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Cherokee. Cherokee. Who did the United States fight during World War II? Who did the United States fight during World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights. Who was the president during the Great Depression during World War II? Who was the president during the Great Depression during World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. What is the name of the national anthem? What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banners. Name two U.S. national holidays. Name two U.S. national holidays. New Year's, Martin Luther King, President's Day. Memorial Day, Independence Day, Labor Day, Columbus Day, Veterans Day, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Because the stripes represents the original colonies. When do we celebrate Independence Day? When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4. Where is the Statue of Liberty? Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Why does the flag have 50 stars? Star represents a state. 
because there are 50 states. Muchas veces pónganlo una y otra vez para que puedan repetirlo y practiquen y se den cuenta qué tanto están avanzando. Eh, muy importante que lo hagan. También vayan a ver cualquiera de estos dos videos que tenemos que les pueden ayudar y se pueden suscribir aquí en este pequeño círculo para que vayan a suscribirse si no lo han hecho. Y recuerden como siempre, ayúdenos dándole un like. Nos estamos viendo en el próximo video.